All right, let's do the derivative with respect to x of sine x or sine x. So that looks interesting, isn't it? So first step, I'm going to let y to be equal to this function here, sine x to power sine x. Then, because this power here is a function of x, we can't do so much, so I have to bring it down. I'll introduce logarithms on both sides. So the natural log of y equals the natural log of sine x to the power sine x. So just bring that down, we have natural log of y equals sine x times the natural log of sine x. And now we can start the differentiation. So I'll take the derivative of this, I have 1 over y, y dx. Here these are two functions, a product of two functions, so I'll use product rule. Let's begin by keeping this constant. We take the derivative of this. Plus, we now keep this constant. We take the derivative of this. And so finally, I get this y multiplied here, so y is sine x. Oops, sine x to the power sine x times everything here. So this cancels with this. We have cos x plus cos x natural log of sine x. All right, thanks for watching. If you find this helpful, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for more, and uh, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.